we get ready for Dodgers and Cubs this year. So we'll focus on his matchup with the, that man right there. Swanson and Ian Happ both have seven games this afternoon. So Gavin still got this way. Cox and turns out that's exactly why he cho noticed, decided to send him a care package, and now he has potent lineup today, Jim Deshays. Yeah, he didn't throw a ton of them. That's a good weapon against the left hand. Betts, Otani, and Freeman Smith yesterday. One fires. Yeah, the first offering of the game in Boston does not like and makes the catch. Pan ended up winning the Miguel Amaya pregame and asked to one. And that ooh, the 3 1. That is a. And the pitch. You're a good example. You didn't throw us. I beg to differ. Fell that out properly. But you're right, yeah. Especially hard, but you lived up in the zone. I said Fernandez. 3 2. Swing and a miss. An extra at 94 and slips it by. And a swing and a miss. Nine. And another. 0 2. And went high. Base out in right center. Freddie Freeman. Contact, but unfortunately for him, Freeman Ibler last year. He was caught only once. He is not a fast runner. Eight, like you're hot. And the 2 0. Bellinger coming in. Cody makes the Bellinger. Thinking the changeup is the pitch that still. And Gavin Stone's first offering. Fifth round draft pick. One. Freeman redirects to Lux. At first base. I love replay because it bails me out. Center safe. Chicago would change the talent. Yeah, there's a fact. Well, you see that more and more, right? <laughs> Clubs I didn't know he went five innings allowed seven. Yeah, time called by Suzuki. Say on Stone. Swing and identifying a pitcher's best pitch is brought to you by Northwestern Medicine Dish. The single to an E3. Bellinger swings. And he's been productive. Hit. He got a slider and big zone from Morel. He played a long guy sleep on stone fires outside the two one. And that one is and that's in the dirt. Yeah, and there. Swing and a miss. Well, mostly second. In the dirt, the two two. Down. And that'll score at least two. Dives in safely. That went down and he's in and he's pumped up there and double. Ooh. And that one. Jitty with going line in the left field and top. The splitter, kind of a slider action the way. And a swing and a bets there. Wandering out and makes a catch. We're sincerely grateful for your service. Come up to hit. Eight, nine, and a one. And he's walked six times. Check swing. Travel. Ball four. He's seen at least five. forever. No doubt. Field. Died a hero did that. Is that, is that sticky stuff? Sticky stuff. Yeah. That is six. Five one in to make it a five nothing game. Certainly credit the Cubs, man. They made you pay. Plays we could have made didn't happen. They took advantage of it. Yeah, grounds crew having themselves a really busy afternoon at Wrigley Field. Fourth inning, Gus Varland comes in, and it's Ian Happ. 
Something about those left-handed hitters going to left center field. It's working out well for them. I mean, the, the left-handed hitters did a good job just staying on it. They weren't flying open, weren't trying to pull it. They just went the other way. It's a double for Hap off of Gus Farland, just called back up from AAA Oklahoma City. Nice effort out there by CT3. Later in the inning, second and third, Christopher Morrell to Miguel Rojas. This is when the field is really sloppy. It's just crazy. He gets a mud ball after he slides on the mud. I'm sure he picks up the ball full of mud, trying to get it over to Freddie Freeman. Just unable to make the play. 6 nothing, Cubs at this point. You can see Miggy Rowe arguing with the umpires about the conditions, how they're unplayable. And you, and you correct the umpires too, man. They let the, the players voice they, their dismay. Yeah. They understood their frustration. After two hours and 50 minutes of a delay, Ryan Yarbrough comes in. Swanson It's an RBI. Field looks better. Fielder's choice. Here's Shohei in the top of the sixth. We have a Dodger highlight. Love it. What's great about, I guess, one, I should say, one bright spot about this game is Shoy Otani is really starting to get locked in. That is really good to see. Swing that Triple, thing. his first Dodger triple. Mm. Oh, man, he's slipping out of the box as well. You know, I was worried, you know, too. Hit, him hitting a triple is nice, but you're also going, yeah. okay, sitting that long, yeah. make sure you're okay. But the Dodgers failed to score in the sixth. Bottom half, Yarbrough still on the mound facing Ian Happ. It's a drive to center. Left really center. good play here by Keith Hernandez. Tough yeah. condition. The wind is swirling. He's got to protect himself. There is no padding on that brick wall. Hard as a rock. Puts his feet out as he's catching the ball. Great play. Cody Bellinger continues a great weekend for the former Dodgers. That one is fair, and it is gone. He does a good job keeping this ball fair because that was, you know, that was off the plate in the inner half. And he just brings the hands in nicely, puts a good swing on it. Eight to nothing. Shohei's going to break up the shutout in the top of the eighth with a drive to deep right center field. That will score Mookie Betts all the way from first. Well, we don't get shut out, John. We're the show Dodgers, okay? We're not going to win this ball game, but we're not going down without a fight. Eight to one. I love when pitchers do that. They point, yeah, there it goes, off the wall. <laughs> yeah, point, like it's a pop-up. Trust me, the outfielders can see it. <laughs> a lot of birds up there flying around, too. Dodgers fall 8-1 the final. They're now 8-4 and four on the season. Gavin Stone is tagged with a loss. He went three innings, gave up five runs. Only one of them was earned. He had five strikeouts. Former Dodger Yancey Almonte continued that good weekend for the Cubs. He got the win. Shohei was two for four, a double, a triple, an RBI, and Freddie Freeman went one for three.